one of the new servants? Remember that I like my meat rare. <laughs> Are you married? How goes the begging today, Brenuin? Old friend. Pay for another. Jewels, wares, and weapons. All I can take you to any. Where do you want to go? Climb and back, and we'll be off. Ever been to Windhelm? Oldest city in Skyrim by some account. They say the big old palace there was built by Yiz... The Greybeards have summoned the Dragonborn. You come here where you're not wanted. You eat our food, you pollute our city with your stink, and you refuse to help the Stormcloaks. But we haven't taken a side because it's not our fight. Hey, maybe the reason these Grayskins don't help in the war is because they're Imperial spies. Imperial spies? You can't be serious. Maybe we'll pay you a visit tonight, little spy. We got ways of finding out what you really are. Oh. Do you hate the Dark Elves? Are you here to bully us and tell us?
You've come to the wrong city then. Windhelm's a haven of prejudice and narrow thinking. Unworthy of one such as... Nothing new there. Most of the Nords living in Windhelm don't care much for us. But Rolf is the worst by far. He likes to get drunk and walk around the Grey Quarter yelling insults at us in the small hours of the morning. Oh, a real charmer, that one. Some of these Nords will come up with any excuse to despise us. And it isn't just the Dark Elves they hate. They make a target of the Argonians as well. In fact, just about anyone who isn't a Nord is fair game for their bullying. All right. I was one of the best. I'd be out there fighting the Imperials right now if it wasn't for my war. What could it mean? The return of the Dragonborn? Give us a straight answer. I do the cooking and cleaning. He's a true Nord. He'll come around. Don't be so sure of that. We've intercepted couriers from Solitude. The Empire is putting a great... Only the foolish or the courageous approach a Jarl without summon. Do I know you? Is that so? Ah, uh, yes. You were with us at Helgen. Destined for the chopping block, if I'm not mistaken. Raylof's alive. I hope that's true. He's a damn good man. But he hasn't returned yet. So I'll need to wait for his account. For now, speak with Galmar. I'm always looking for able fighters. Not everyone can say they made it out of Helgen. Seems we're all branded villains these days. So long as your criminal past stays in the past. And you fight for me with honor and integrity. We'll welcome you into our ranks. And what would you have me do? If he's not with us, he's against us. He knows that. They all know that. How long are you going to wait? You think I need to send Volgroth a stronger message? If by message you mean shoving a sword through his gullet. Taking his city and leaving him in disgrace would make a more powerful statement, don't you think? So we're ready to start this war in earnest, then? Soon. I still say you should take them all out like you did dead King Torig. Torig was merely a message to the other Jarls. Whoever we replace them with will need the support of our armies. We're ready when you are. Things hinge on Whiterun. If we can take the city without bloodshed, all the better. But if not... The people are behind you. Many, I fear, the still need convincing. The Stormcloaks are finding victory across the land. Then let them die with their false kings. We've been soldiers a long time. We know the price of freedom. But people are still weighing things in their hearts. What's left of Skyrim to wager? They have families to think of. How many of their sons and daughters follow your banner? We are their families. Well put, friend. Tell me, Galmar, why do you fight for me? Hmm, Helgen, eh? Now, but first, tell me, why does a foreigner want to fight for Skyrim? Fair enough, but are you willing to die for your home? Uh, can't fault anyone for that. As long as you hate the Empire as much as I do, that I can work with. All right. But before I can put you to use, I need to know how much you can take. I have a little test. That's what I like to hear. So long as you can back up those words with steel. I'm sending you to Serpentstone Island. If you survive, you pass. If you die, well, you weren't going to be much use to me anyway. It's where men have tested their metal for ages. 
It's a strange rock formation built by the ancients. Something about that place attracts the ice wraiths. You kill an ice wraith out there, and I'll have all the proof I need about you. I'd follow you into the depths of oblivion. You know that. Yes, but why do you... If Are you ready for Serpent Stone? It's where men have... It's a str you kill an ice wraith out there, and I'll have all the proof I need about you. We'll see about that. Here, take this. Try not to die. I'll die before elves dictate them. I fight for the men I've held in my arms. Dying. By the gods, it's true, is it? A dragon has attacked White Man. It's no secret the Aretino boy is doing some ritual. Need a ride? Where do you want to go? Climb and back and we'll be off. Get up there.
time and dwindling resources chasing a legend. We don't even know it exists. The yo You're alive. I misjudged you. It's time we made this official. You ready to take the oath? Not at all. I wasn't sure. Now, if we're done being sentimental before your one, you must also pledge unswerving loyalty to your fellow storm. That's the sp I do swear my blood and honor to the Jarl of Windhelm and true High King of Sky. As Talos is my witness, even to my lord, as to my fellow brothers and... All hail the Stormcloaks, the true sons and daughters of... Now you're one of us, which means you get to tag along on a little trip with me. Oh, and here. You're a Stormcloak now. You ought to look the part. Watch yourself out there. Hmm? I have found the f We're headed. Your fellow Stormcloaks are already assembling outside the... They demand the moot. I'm right behind you. I am sworn to carry your burdens. I am sworn to carry your burdens. Let's get going then. <laughs> 